Push-ups are an excellent bodyweight exercise for developing upper body strength since they work your chest, triceps, shoulders, and core. Dip Bar Push-ups, another name for parallel bar push-ups, elevate this traditional exercise by involving more muscle groups. The deeper range of motion provided by parallel bars, which are elevated bars, makes push-ups harder and more effective. Many of us incorporate push-ups into their workout routines, but have you ever wondered what would happen to your body when you do push-ups using parallel bars? Join us as we delve into the benefits and potential risks associated with this exercise. Stick around until the conclusion, it'll be interesting. But before we dive in, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell, so you never miss any of our fitness-related content. Let's go! Let's now examine the many advantages of including parallel bar push-ups in your exercise regimen. Increased range of motion, deeper dipping is possible thanks to the higher bars, which work more of your chest, shoulders, and triceps than typical push-ups do. Greater core activity, the higher core activity needed to balance on the parallel bars results in greater stability and balance. Enhanced grip strength, the grip needed to hold onto the parallel bars helps your forearm and hand muscles get stronger. Targets additional muscle groups, parallel bar push-ups work the lower chest, serratus anterior, and even the upper back in addition to the chest, shoulders, and triceps. Scapular mobility, push-ups against a parallel bar require controlled scapular movement, which enhances shoulder mobility and strength. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to performing parallel bar push-ups correctly. Put your hands on the parallel bar's shoulder width apart with your palms facing down. Throughout the exercise, maintain a tight hold. Depending on the height of the bars, stand in front of them and lower your body by bending at the knees or leaping up. For balance, keep your feet close together or just slightly apart. By bending your elbows and keeping a straight line from your shoulders to your feet, lower your body toward the bars. Extend your arms fully and push yourself back up to the starting position. Maintain a tight core the entire time you're moving. During parallel bar push-ups, several muscles in your upper body and core are actively engaged. Here are the primary muscles worked during this exercise. Chest, pectoralis major and minor when performing parallel bar push-ups, your body is pushed away from the bars by the contraction of your chest muscles. Shoulders, deltoids as you lower and lift your body, the deltoid muscles in your shoulders help to stabilize and sustain the motion. Triceps brachii, during the pushing phase of the workout, your triceps, which are positioned at the rear of your upper arms, push your body up and extend your elbows. Core muscles, to maintain stability and control throughout the activity, the parallel bar push-up also works your core muscles, such as the rectus abdominis, transverse abdominis, and obliques. Serratus anterior, during parallel bar push-ups, the serratus anterior, a muscle on the sides of your upper chest, contracts to stabilize the shoulder blades and help with the exercise. Upper back, rhomboids and trapezius, during the exercise, your upper back muscles, particularly the rhomboids and trapezius, assist in stabilizing your shoulder blades and preserving good posture. Forearm and grip muscles, holding onto the parallel bars, need strong grip, using the forearm and hand muscles. Potential risks and precautions. While parallel bar push-ups offer numerous benefits, they may not be suitable for everyone. Let's look at some potential risks and precautions. Shoulder strain, when performing parallel bar push-ups incorrectly, the shoulders may be strained. Before doing this workout, it's critical to speak with a fitness expert or a healthcare physician if you already have shoulder problems. Wrist discomfort, for some people, especially those who have wrist issues, the wrist posture during parallel bar push-ups might be uncomfortable. To ease wrist stiffness, start with wrist mobility exercises and take push-up handles into consideration. Overtraining, to avoid overtraining and injuries, it's important to give your body enough time to recover between workouts, like with any exercise. 
This brings us to the end of today's video. Finally, parallel bar push-ups are a great exercise to incorporate into your regimen because they build muscular engagement and improve functional strength. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more health and fitness tips. See you in the next one.